Well, hello. Today it's my birthday and I'm going to have a 24 hours subathon. I hope that you will enjoy this and you can spread it to all your friends and hoping you will have a nice time with these pictures. Here you see my father with his baby brother and his little brother's father. My grandmother got pregnant without being married. And that was a big scandal at 1926. Here is my mother Clara and her parents. They were so kind and was living in a little house in a big forest in Sweden. And they had 11 children there. Marvelous. Here is my beautiful mother Clara. She's about 30 years old at this picture. And here is my father Rolf when he was doing his military duty and he was about 18 years old in this picture. Well, I do not think this is me, but they have always said so. No, I think it's the little boy, but it's my grandparents' house where they lived. This is me, I can assure you. I'm 12 years old and I'm a scout. Quite cute, don't you think so? And this, and this is me, I'm sure. <laughs> I am 14 or 15 years old here. And um, I think I just did my confirmation. Wrong word, but I did it. Well, now I'm 16 years old. Oh, and I'm pregnant, pregnant with my first child. Well, here I'm sure I'm pregnant. I'm about six months. Very colorful dresses. Well, it was like that this year. Here is my only brother, Glenn, at age 14. He became a drug addict and took his own life. So kind, soft and so nice. But I think he is better off where he is now. And here I'm pregnant again, but it's the third pregnancy. It's Thomas in my stomach or in my uterus. So it's 12 years later than the first one. And here he has come out, came out. He's in the box to the right. My mom asked me if I expected one more. My sister standing beside got her baby girl just four days earlier, and look at her body, not fair at all. And here is Thomas, three to four years old. You can ask him later on the stream how I was as a mother. Look at the dress. Wow. But look at this, this is me after my divorce. I didn't want to divorce. It was my husband who left me. And that is the best diet in the whole world. I lost many kilos. I'm 39 years old. 
and no one should say to me that it's fun to get as old as I am now. Everything is falling down. I have graduated to become, to become a trained nurse and I reached my goal. I was so proud and I think I look quite nice. Here is Alf, my, the man of my life. He's running Broloppet. They opened the connection between Denmark and Sweden and people was allowed to run from one side to another. After I met Alf, we joined a couple of lodges. So here comes a few ball gowns. This lilac I think is rather fine. Here you see my favorite, but I was thinner when I bought it. In this picture, Alf has helped me to press in the fat so we can close the zip. And here we are on a lodge. This blue one is so nice to wear. It's kind and very nice to the body. Here are a friend of mine out in her car. She was taking me just for fun. Thanks Mimi, we had a really lovely day, but the pizzeria was closed. Here is my first grandchild. It's a boy. And on the picture you can see my mother, me and my daughter and the little guy. And here is grandchild number two. It's my father, my son and my little grandchild daughter. No, not my daughter, sorry. It's the girl. And me, look at how thin I am. Look at this beautiful person. It's the girl grown up and she's testing my dress from 1972. She is so beautiful. And here you can see, I love candy and cookies. And one of my birthday, I think it was two or three years ago, my moderators had fixed this for me. Well, I can tell you I'm not that fond of pony anymore after eating all of this. And here you see my moderators, so nice and so helpful. Without them, I couldn't have managed to be that person on streaming I am today. Here I am at my first, <coughs> sorry, my first dream hack. I met these two wonderful girls there and they took so good care of me. Thanks, Gabby and Felicia. I had a lovely time. And I even met Dart, Dart Wader, not Dark Wader, Dart Wader. And on the sign it says, together we make dream hack. The year after, my second time on DreamHack, then I streamed from the stream studio there. That was a really experience. I even had to write autographs. Yeah. And I bought some things just to remember. In Twitch Lounge, you can get the, you can be when you get tired, there are food and drinks and nice people. 
I have been in newspapers, TV and radio and asked to talk about being elder and a gamer. So this was on Kungsmässan where I talked just about that. It's not dangerous to be a gamer if you are a, an elder. And here are the proof. I'm standing on a scene talking to the people. I had the hon honor to win the title Årets Nätengel Gaming because I tried to have a clean and nice dream without swear words and bullying. I was so proud. I get this diploma and I got a very nice brush in silver in form of an angel. But I have done, done <clears throat> I'm so sorry, but I have done other things than gaming. I wrote this book about my life, sold about 300. Lena is my second name and Clara's daughter means Clara's daughter. I wanted them to be an anonymous <clears throat> then, but I regret that today. But that was then. Alf and I love to travel both in Sweden and abroad. Here we are on our way to Paris for our honeymoon. We are eating waffles and we are going on a bus, a tourist bus. Sweden with loads of cranes. It's called the Crane Dance. They land here and they always live in pairs. So, well, it's nice to learn and see different things in life. And here we are in Leksand, it's in Dalarna. We are looking on an art project. It's a golden egg and you could go into it too. Well, here I haven't a clue about this clever guy is, but I think he looked as clever as me. <laughs> and it's all artificial, but some flowers, we must have some flowers at my place. And here we got married in 1926, no, <laughs> in 2006. And he's just giving me the ring. My precious. Well, here you see Notre Dame in Paris, in Paris. Paris, La Defense, it's a very, very big building. You can go in both on the sides and up. And it's a marvelous building. And here is Arc de Triomphe, Triumphbogen as we say in Sweden, also Paris, Arc de Triumph. I don't know if that's correct. And here is the Eiffel Tower, still in Paris. And we went up on the top, Alf and I, and we stood there. And I had a pencil with me, and I wrote our name at them in there. <laughs> I wrote our name there. Alf Hart Susan. Oh, <laughs> so silly. And here is me and Shrek in Poland. 
who was a Gdynia Gdansk and Sopot. And I just had to say hello to Shrek. Yes. Looks nice. We sat high up and took a beer. And it was on this on nestet or eagle place in Deutschland. It was here Hitler lived. And to get to this place, you have to go in a small, um, small, small, small way. And then take an elevator in gold up. And the way in is 120 meters and the elevator goes 120 meter up. And this is a memory uh, <clears throat> beside the eagle. Stalbash, my favorite place. There were there were flowers and there were music and the sun was shining all the time. So just fantastic. Salbach is in Austria. And one of the evenings they had a little um, street festival with music, food and such things. And this little guy had a plastic trumpet and he played and he was so good to follow the music and dance and so on. And you can see every, not everyone drinking beer because there were many children too. The day after we, we went to Selam Sea and they had boats looking like this swan on the picture and Alf had to tramp um, cycle that boat so we got forward and I just relaxed. Um, and they had a um, cable car. I'm not, know, uh, I'm not sure that is the correct word, but still they had a lean barn. And it went so high up in the mountains. I really like that kind of adventures. And then we were in Italy in Pisa and I tried to fix the tower but I didn't manage it's still a bit sneered can't find the word well we went on a cruise <coughs> sorry again we went on a cruise in Russia and I got a bit drunk, as you can see on this picture. We started in St. Petersburg and we took the flight to St. Petersburg. And then we boarded the boat and cruised the whole way to Moscow. So many locks because there are so um big difference in height bef between St. Petersburg and Moscow. And here I am at the Red Square. It's not that red, maybe the buildings. Röda torget, we say in Sweden, Röda torget. You can see I love this shirt. 
I have it on many pictures because I just feel nice in that one. Nice hat too, don't you think? But just wait, here it comes. This one is better, don't you think? <laughs> I'm a bit crazy, but I think you must have fun in life. And here is Alf in the castle, the winter palace or the Eremitage. It was oh, so much gold and gold and gold and gold. And now we are in Prague. It was a bit cold, but you can see there are musicians on the street. But Prague was much of up and downs and up and downs, and you got so tired. But we took the local bus. And we ended up at an ice hockey hall. My word. The man at the door said, just come in. So we did. And it was Prague playing hockey. It was a very nice experience because they were really in for the game. I mean, the public. They screamed and they was all over the top. And here is the astronomic clock in Prague. It's world famous. And here I just think it's the horse parking. But I can't see any any way to pay for the parking. <laughs> and just a lovely picture on, of Alf and me. Newly married and so happy. And here we was in a very um, odd shop. It, it, it sold like torture things. We didn't buy anything, I promise. So, well, I don't know what I think about that art. You can see the hills down and up and down and up. But it was lovely. And here we are in Belgium and mannequin piece. It's made in bronze and it's from 1618 or 1619. So it's a very, very old little guy doing his needs. Uh, did you know there are... Uh, um, Oh, I can't find the word right now, but there is a girl also that is peeing. Um, no, I can't find the word, but there is. And they had Belgian waffles. So good and so nice. But we didn't eat all of this. This was just to show what they offered. And Tintin, um, I think he is written in Belgium or of a Belgis, Belgium. Here, back in Sweden, in Gothenburg, Volvo Ocean Race. I got the first prize. Not. It's just fake, but quite fun anyway. And I tested to fold a book or several books. It is really fun. You take a book and you have um, 
um, monster, you have a schedule you should um, fold it from. And it could be like this. Fantastic. And this is me, Koprov, one of my friends on the stream, did this newspaper for me. But I can tell you, I never had blue hair. And here is me and Thomas as an adult. He, um, he took me out on Mother's Day. And here is my fourth grandchild. So nice and well, they are all nice and can tell you. And here I tried out as a model for a day. You can see, see this blouse again. They had done my makeup and I feel like <clears throat> here I am as an Easter groom. And of course, Alf is with me. You can see many of the pictures are not that good, but you will know what I mean. That's the most important. And then I broke my foot quite bad. So I had to have plastic for 12 weeks. First, I had a white. It was um, after I've been on the, in the hospital. Then I had a purple. Then I had a blue one. I think the blue was before the purple. And then I had a pink one. And at the very, sorry, but when it was nearly healed, then I had to have this clumsy boot. I have done gymnastics in my stream. I did three things and then I said, Oh, I'm tired. But we had a fun time. Here is my daughter at our place in uh, Blekinge in southern Sweden. She is helping me putting up some wallpapers. And here is my granddaughter. Uh, she is and was a very promising shooter, rifle shooter, and she had uh, trainers, one of the best trainers in Sweden, so she was really, really good. And she won many prizes, but then she had a car accident and had to stop. And to be quite honest, I don't know if she's on it again. Here is little Jonna, only three years old. I just love this picture with all these pink and purple colors. And the sweet little girl in, in the middle. I can't show my uh, grandsons that much because they don't like that. If Just if you have any questions about why some are and some don't. Here is my first gaming computer. I played World of Warcraft, but I didn't stream. Here you can see my setup, isn't it lovely? I got Rosa from Alf. 
and then I thought I then I started to stream and then I must have another laptop so I took the old one and had the stream on the one to the right and played on the left and Alf has built the table but then Asus gave me this computer what a feeling and here are some things that Asus also sent me a headset a gaming um, you can see in the pictures, I'm feeling a bit tired in my head now. I'm not used to speak English. And you can see the poly. They sent the poly in the package. Here is the new computer. God, tangent board. I can't find the word for the... Uh, writing well well I had I got, even got a nice screen from Asus and I bought, bought a little one it's the one to the left but then a Rossi came into the picture and they gave me the blue gaming table So nice with flowers and red and so on. But then I got a chair and a carpet from Marossi. So everything went over to blue. And then it became pink. Pink heads that pink. Why can't I find that well? Pink, 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 pink to write on. <laughs> and a pink mouse. And this is my setup right now. The screens is from Enet and it's MSI curved screen. So it's really lovely. I think it's nice. I can say that because I've got all the parts from other people. And on stream we have had mount offs. It's a quite an it's quite a nice way to socialize on stream. This is just a lovely picture from Bob and Sandala. Here is another mount of. So nice picture. And here we have a transmog competition. I can't see which. Well, there are many people. And here is another transmog competition. And here you see my three grown up children. I won't tell you their names. More than the one to the left is Thomas. And here are my four grandchildren. I will only name Jonna. She's the youngest. But I must say they are so sweet, all of them. And you can see these two brothers, they are so fun and here 
And last but not least, my husband Alf, the man in my life, the man of my life. He is marvelous, kind, caring. Well, you name it and I will agree. So this was all for this um, film because I made it as a film because I didn't know how to do anyway. So enjoy and please stay put if you like it. Bye bye.